everybody. We are getting ready for a boot camp session. So join us. 60 minutes of lifting and some funky stuff with your legs. So let's do this. If you're taking this one, I need to have another one, I said. Okay? We are, I did foam rolling already. And now we need to stretch the legs and prepare upper body for the motion as well. So get yourself some dumbbells, get yourself some bands. And let's do this. Let's do this. I said just finished school. And now he ate something quick. Now he's ready to work out. Ivanka is jump roping. Ivanka, how many can you do now? 35 jump ropes. She barely started a few days ago and she already uh, is able to do 35 jump ropes, which means persistence, uh, right? Persistence and repetition and trying to get better. That's what it's all about. And not quitting. Not quitting. That's right. Not quitting. So we were trying to get live on Instagram, but unable to. So we are just broadcasting today on on Facebook. So let's get that stretch strap and stretch your legs up and down. Hold it for a few seconds. My hamstrings are super on fire, tight, even though I foam rolled them already. Let's stretch the glute and release. Stretch the glute and release. And bring the leg out to the side, my friends, out to the side. Let's stretch those inner thighs, shoulders, back, chest is out. And bring it up and over the opposite direction. Yes, okay, good lower back stretch, yes. The other shoulder arm is on the floor. I'm just gonna hold it here, Tyson is moving up and down. And I'm gonna finish with over the shoulder, nice good squat stretch right here, feeling it in the quad area. Oh, this feels good, that hold position sometimes. You really need to feel your body in and, and, and think, okay, do I need to more motion today or I just need to hold that static stretch? Sometimes I just do that and it feels better than just going up and down with that leg because I need I need that static stretching to really, really elongate the muscle. So again, guys, if you're replaying this right now, you're just starting, make sure you're foam rolling. If you foam roll already, just do the stretches with us. Maybe you already did the stretches and you're gonna jump right into the session. That's fine. Just make sure that you never, ever start the workout without any kind of proper stretching techniques, okay? So that's important. And cross the body. Oh, this feels good. That lower back right here. Shoulder on the floor. At least trying to bring that forearm on the floor. And we're gonna finish with the quad stretch right here. Heel into the glute, deep breath in through your nose, exhale through your lips. Stay sideways, feel the stretch. And awesome, right here, perfect. So, this is done. We're gonna put my gloves on. Who is with us? Hello, everybody. Hello. Okay, so get the dumbbells going. I can. I'm right here. Well, I'm recording. So, you can stay with us for this if you like. Who has dumbbells? Who has kettlebells? We're going to start with, of course, chest press on the floor. Are you going to be doing floor or bench, guys? Bench? Okay, so get the other one, the flat one, you can get the flat one. I'm going to move this one to the side. So get the other one. I'm going to use this one. Okay, so set this one up. I am going to use my ball because I just did chest press on Monday uh, on the bench. So today I'm going to use the ball. And look, if you don't have dumbbells, just use kettlebell. Whatever you have at home. You can do kettlebell. Sure, absolutely. You can. All right. So, how do you really properly set yourself up on the ball? You gotta first catch the ball, and you gotta roll out to a high to, to a really tabletop position right here. That's why I said do the other one. Hips are up, chest is out, and we're gonna start right here. So the glutes are automatically working. Your upper body is working, abs are working. 
Okay. Glutes, hamstrings on fire right here. Nice and steady, slow motion. That's why I love the ball. Love the ball to do that because it's entirely total body exercise right here. Just don't hold the breath. Breathe out with the movement. And, and time. Well, Tyson's going to finish off. All right, guys. So we're going to get the dumbbell can start later. You have to kind of watch the motion here, okay? Because we're going to place the dumbbell on the floor. And we're going to do a crisscross jack. Then we're going to lift with the other arm. Then crisscross jack and lift. Then crisscross, boom, boom, lift, then crisscross, lift. So it's a one jump, one crisscross, and you're alternating those arms. So look, place it down, up, up. So it forces you to go all the way down, all the way up. Enough repetition. And your legs are on fire. Look, you gotta go all the way down, all the way up. You wanna try the Dasa Banka? And time. We're gonna finish off with chest press right now with the, with the band. So make sure your bands are attached. If you don't have a band, go on the floor. Clean it, clean it. Go on the floor and and do a push up. What happened over there? You okay? All right. So just clean it and come back. Okay. A little water. Always chaos in this house. Where is not? Tyson, you like on top of me. <laughs> Come on, Tyson, move a little bit on the side. Here you go, right there. So pump that chest for me. Chest is open. Control those bands, guys. This is not just a demo, it's a full workout. So we're gonna get a full workout with us. Ah, and time. So we just did those three exercises. Just stretch in between. We're gonna do chest press again, but the second time around, this bend's gonna happen immediately, immediately after your chest press. Then you're gonna do that squat with crisscross jack. Got it? All right. So let's do this. My hamstrings are super tight, guys. How are yours? They good? They good? All right. Let's go, guys, again. Sit on that ball. Walk your feet out. 90 degree angle. I'm not increasing the weight here. If anything, I will increase the numbers. Pump it. Control it. Strong, strong. Number 13. Keep that neck flat. Chin away from your chest. Lift those dumbbells above your chest, not above your head. And time. Good work. Listen, if you need to throw a few more, and just do it but it's not required you do what you can get that bend and let's go again no i said it's i explained it the second time is the bend
10 is after and then we do squat with that deadlift really deadlift Oof. we have to jump so pump your chest you can switch your leg if you want it you can have the other leg forward you can switch your legs out the round Your knees bent. Ah, time. Whew. All right, let's get that dumbbell going. So again, look, I'm placing it right here. I'm alternating the arms. So it's deadlift, drop, crisscross. Boom, all the way down, right? pretty deep. I feel it in my hamstrings. Ah. Abs, glutes, everything is working. Ah. Strong, strong. Squat low. Lean forward low. stretching the heart rate is catching up right now if your heart rate is that high if you're not like out of breath that means that you're either doing too light not jumping hard enough not lifting hard enough so push yourself in the next one a little bit more okay make sure you're doing this guys Whew. all right drinking of course my Pre-workout, but we always say pre-workout. We drink this throughout the session, guys. Yes, I see a bunch of you here. Patore. Nice. Thank you guys for staying with us, Bernadette and Gerardo. Yes, Kathy. Ken, thank you. And, of course, write it down where you're coming from. Put it in the comments. And, of course, if you need help with anything, most people struggle with fitness and nutrition. Bottom line. Bottom line. It's always a problem. It's a very simple process, but it mixed up uh, by many. And to achieve weight loss, it requires consistency, right? And not starvation, I always say that. The starvation will never last until eventually. Did you see this? Did you see this? Hey, 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 hey! He's drinking my pre-workout. Oh, wow. My magic. The magic concoction that I have there. All right, let's lift some weight. Are you lifting the same amount as I have? Are you having 20 pounds over there? Mm -hmm. Yes, this boy is nine years old and he's lifting as much as I do. All right. <laughs> Strong, strong, strong hips are, hips are up, guys. If you are on the ball with me, please do not sink your hips down. This will require your hamstrings and glutes and abs to really go through a strong hold here.
Come on, guys, come on. Power up, maybe some, some push-ups there. That's what it takes. Ah! Don't finish just because I finished. Push a little few more, push a little, push a little more. Like cause yourself to be out of breath, okay? All right. So now, Peyton, you ready? Which one is yours? Oh, hand is on fire. So look, leaning forward, it's not squatting, it's leaning forward because this is a deadlift, lift, place it down, crisscross, out, down, crisscross, lift, ah, ah, crisscross. Do some 
push-ups if you don't if you're not doing the band, okay? Do push-ups. I'm gonna show everybody how to do push-ups. We don't do this exercise. I don't know what it, it is. Um, that's not really safe for your shoulders. Or if you have to. Back. 
Chest out. Let's bump. So look, we're not going this way, we're going that way. It's important, we need to be slightly bent. Your abs are engaged, your glutes are engaged. Everything is with full control. Hands going along the side of your body. You're breaking a nice sweat at this point. And then again, don't let go of that band. A lot of you are going to do that. And you got to resist. Keep the control over that band. Okay? your legs, legs, glutes. I keep on stretching the hamstrings because hammies are super tight. Uh, for the past two days, we've done crazy workouts, so that's why they are tired. But it wasn't exactly what we're doing right now. Should Always I different. Should I maybe gonna do bench press well? So we're gonna bench press like two hundred tons. How many? How many? How many pounds does whale weigh? Like, three, put in the comments. Okay, never mind, I won't answer. Put in the comments. We want to know if you know. So that's what we're going to be doing. A challenge. 24 hours weightlifting. Fun, right? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Alright, so what we're doing now is you, you remember, it's gonna be left leg, but second round, you gotta get those dumbbells to the bend overall, right guys? So left leg, let's do this, right? Is that the one that it's moving? Yeah, it is. Tyson tooth is moving and it's hurting him. It's gonna get out in like five minutes. We're just gonna get it. Pull it. Pull it, pull it. Ready? Go. Go! Ivanka, bend over the row. Ah. Oh. Bend. Second time. Oh, I remember those times. Those are, especially when it's like just hanging on one side and you and you bite and you move and it's just hurting, right? You guys remember those times? It actually tickles kind of to me when I like... Really? You guys remember those times that you were losing your teeth? What if there's a kid on it? Ah, uh, well maybe a kid is on that. You remember just the other day you lost your tooth? <laughs> Live! 
On Facebook, he just lost the tooth. This is pretty cool. Lamb's victory. No Woo! He just lost one. Ah, from there you go, Tasty. No. Ah, stay straight, guys. Stay straight. Don't lean to one side. Ah. Don't lift with your back. Bend your legs. I want you to bend your legs. Like bend them. Boom. Extend. Down. Jack. Oh. Ha. Ah. Down. And jack. One more. My legs are on fire, Tyson. Are yours? You just started, but my glutes. Oh. You should see the jump for it. <laughs> nice. He's toothless now. I can spit in my He's toothless now. Whew. This one is good. All right, guys, what's in your pre workout? Listen, so many of you, so many of you don't know or don't, don't know how to make a pre workout, don't know how to exercise, don't know the nutrition, or maybe simply you fall off the wagon. It happens. And the point is to just get back on it. Now, peak freaks know what to do, but I also realized that a lot of former peak freaks lost it completely. And that tells me the ones that are not on board, the ones that are not on the app, on the application working out, tells me a lot. Means you didn't really develop the habit. That's the hardest part. So you need a community, you need someone to relate to and have a constant touch with, with the coach, and that's what we do on our application. Please stop. Please stop. It's good. <laughs> you cannot have that much. All right, guys. Back to the band overall. Let's do this. Ready? Feeling flipping awesome. Bending forward, shoulders back, chest is up. Let's do this, Tice. Come on, throw it. Tell me how many you're gonna do. Thank you, thank you. Ah, ah. All right, 
as you realize, the left one burns too. The other one, right? Totally. All right. We gotta go one more time. One more time. Bend over. So, one more time. You doing this side? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah, yeah, do this side. That's it. Well, it's last time right now. We're going to the next one. How, how many are we going to do this side? I'll try it. I will go for 20. Three, two, one. Good form. Awesome guys. Because we're gonna have 
dumbbells. Let's do this overhead press. Oh, why do we have eight minutes? Eight minutes for what? Twenty minutes. Twenty minutes. Okay. Let's go. No, oh, we started off. Okay. They're too hot. It's okay. No. <sighs> go this way. Because I did already lifting that way. So we're going to do it this way. Abs tight, glutes tight, overhead press. Control it, guys. I tell you, at this point, your arms will be tired. Yes, maybe adjust the weight, maybe go a little bit lighter. Because be careful with your lower back. Because overhead press puts a lot of pressure on your lower back, okay? This you go inside. Go pump it. Keep on going, keep on going. We squatting. Squat. Squat, but again, look, after the squat, so many of you will want to do just this. Being lazy. No. You got to squat, squat with us, squat, and then drop it, looking straight ahead, okay? Get your bang. Pump it. Burn it. After. 
gonna do one more of this and then one more group I want to start it's already three o'clock did somebody check the time sure it's 2.59 give me the good time the real time the real time okay it's actually 3.12 that was 20 minutes so yeah let's wrap it up <laughs> let's wrap it up you said 20 it's minutes three o'clock all right ready go and then after we have biceps knees bend and stay Breathe out. Arms overhead. Burn it. Don't stop because I stop. Don't stop because I stop. Call the clown. Oh, oh gosh. What's his name? The crazy clown. Jack.
finishing up. One more group. One more group. So, but that was only three rounds. Ah. We are going to the bicep curl. You guys are ready? Pick dumbbells. We're gonna move, clean the other ones. So this is a part of your workout too. You're cleaning the dumbbells, putting stuff away. Come on guys, come on, get the 20s. into the band. Oh, this ball. This ball. Go, 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 bicep curl. You can do a standing band or you can do this band. You can get the standing one and pump your bicep or you can stay with me right here. Shoulders back, chest is out. Go. Pump it. Keep your elbows tucked in. I started bleeding four times today. I hope you stop it. In four different spots. Three on this leg and one on this. Front and back jacks with the deadlift. So look, now we're gonna go into leaning forward. This is a finish line. You gotta do a full deadlift. So from here, lift, drop it. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. All the way down. Gonna have kettlebells here too. <laughs> I didn't even say it, I was like off the beat. Have <sighs> side good side because you're going all the way down to the floor, guys. This is a lot of pressure on your back. Ah! going forward we still have time all right guys let's do this
Pump it. with the coach has interaction uh, with other apps so it connects I can see how you eat what you eat it's really phenomenal and I strongly recommend you to sign up and have these workouts in the palm of your hand follow along with motivational videos every day so you don't need to miss on anything it was never introduced uh, like like this anything to peak members so this is a totally new platform uh, for us and it's amazing so enjoy it Send me messages, of course, the big freaks that are on it, they're going to be sending me messages. They have to reply to messages. And I will talk to you guys soon. Have a no excuses. Daisy Ivanka, you want to say something at the end of the session? Uh -huh. No! Excuses! Tyson always waits for this, and I love the finish line. All right, guys, that's how you should view your day, view your week, view your month you your life and today we had an amazing episode of the no excuses ladies network remember it's a tribe it's a network it's a weekly show uh, that i host on the page of no excuses ladies please please all of you if you are a guy 
send your wife over there. If you are a guy, send your girlfriend over there. If you are a guy and you want to join, you're more than welcome because everybody are welcome there. Everyone, I want everyone to be on it and be active and join us for the weekly show. But the whole thing is that everyone needs a coach. Like, I am a coach myself, but if I would... Would I go to someone else's uh, training session? Absolutely. Because the other coach can push me even though I can push myself. But the other person will also push me and keep me accountable. That's why everyone needs a coach. So think about all the all the people, you know, even in sports. They needed coaching. So you need to sign up for coaching. You need to have someone that keeps you accountable. And that's a new thing that we've been doing. The Operate to Dominate. Look at this. Operate to dominate OTD, mind, body, and business. Private one-on-one -on -one coaching with weekly coaching calls, which has been ama amazing. Daily homework and other things that we have for you. So again, join us. Whichever one is good for you, maybe just the workouts, that's fine. Maybe you need someone that will keep you accountable on your game on your a game that that's the otd is for you so send us a message and we can talk i will talk to you guys later have a no excuses day and you can submit everything right here i'm just gonna quickly add this if i can right now and uh, of course the no excuses network i am going to add here no excuses group right here and of course, I am going to add the submission form for you that if you, if I can, because right now it seems like I cannot, uh, that you can fill up your submission to the 101 coaching. And I will host a 15 minute call with you just to see if you right person for the program, if you commit it and we can, talk more about this so make sure that you are submitting yourself here on this page i'm still looking so bear with me there's a lot of different clipboards here that i have and yes here we go found it awesome all right guys thank you so much for joining us i will talk to you later have a no excuses day bye